Hi my dear friends praise Jesus and welcome to my channel I'm so excited to be showing you my simple wash day regimen today as you can see my hair is very dirty and very dry so I really need to do something so I'm going in with this moisture replacing shampoo from dark and lovely and as you can see my hair is already wet so I'm just going in with the shampoo and just to massage my scalp and wash my hair so this is my all-time favorite shampoo it is a very very nice shampoo that I have been using and it, it cleans my scalp very well and leaves my hair feeling uh, very soft and also shiny so it is a very nice shampoo that I have been using for for quite some time and I really enjoy using it so and as you can see I like washing my hair in smaller sections just because it really helps me to detangle my hair very quickly and also just to wash my hair very quickly and also like it helps my hair to keep stretched and I really enjoy it and also as you can see I don't comb my hair from uh, from the root I comb my hair from the tip going all the way to the root so just to avoid like my hair breaking and just to make sure that I do not damage my hair so it's just a very nice way and a very nice routine just to not comb your hair from the roots going to the, the tip and also I do not comb my hair when my hair is dry so I usually comb my hair when I am washing it and maybe during the week when I need to wash my hair I just spray my hair with a bottle of water just to make my hair damp and then I comb because if you comb your hair when it is dry you're subjecting your hair to break it so uh, I don't want that so that's what I basically do so if you're new here to my channel you're so welcome and you can support my channel by subscribing liking sharing and leaving a comment in the comment section below I really appreciate that you just stopped by just to watch my video so it is very important and very valuable to me and I highly appreciate so thank you So guys, today I just want us to share from the book of Psalm uh, 9, verse 1, the Bible says, I will praise you, Lord, with all my heart. I will tell of all the marvelous things you have done. Like all of us have a story to tell about God, what he has done in our life, and how good he has been in our life. So it is just a way of us expressing our attitude and our our thankfulness to God and praising uh, is just expressing to God our appreciation and understanding of his words and it is just saying thank you for every aspect of his divine nature and an inward attitude becomes outward expression when we are praising God and it is just a nice way of just saying uh, thank you to God for everything that he has done you know even just waking up and feeling healthy is is a miracle so we need also to cultivate a habit of uh, saying thank you to god it's a very nice way to appreciate god for what he has done in our life and what he is yet to do in our life because we know god is faithful so whatever he says and whatever he promises in our life he will make it come to pass so we also need to appreciate him how will you feel guys if you're giving something to someone and they don't say anything about it like they just don't appreciate you sometimes you feel offended and you complain like oh and god does not complain it's not that god needs our appreciation but it's just a way of expressing our sense of gratitude to him so we need to cultivate that attitude of saying thank you to god I hope this was helpful and you enjoyed listening to it.
So guys, I just rinsed out the shampoo and now I'm just going in with this deep treatment from Mega Growth. So it is a very nice treatment. Uh, it leaves my hair feeling soft and very shiny. So it is my favorite conditioner. So I'm just going in with it and just applying it and twisting my hair again. Like it has helped me to just uh, control uh, hair breakage like my hair was breaking before and now like the rate has gone down so it is a very nice conditioner it controls hair breakage and also it restores shine to your hair and I also feel like it also controls split ends because I had split ends on my hair and now they are gone they are gone so I think it does so I don't know but for me that's what I feel let me know what you think about uh, this hair regimen in the comment section below and we can have a conversation there So guys I'm done applying the conditioner and I'm just going to leave it on my hair for about 10 minutes and I will rinse it off. As you can see I have rinsed out the conditioner and now here we are my hair is clean and moisturized and now I'm just going in with this deep uh, leave-in treatment so I'm just going in just to apply and just uh, also apply the Afro moisturizing butter from Dark and Lovely and also sealing in the moisture with this uh, oil this is a mixture of castor oil and olive oil so these are my favorite oils and they are really nice oil like castor promotes hair growth and also it helps in uh, thinning hair like it helps your hair to become thicker so it is a very nice oil that you want to consider using on your hair So guys, I'm not going to like do a protective hairstyle today because I did not want this video to be too long. So I'm going to do a, a hairstyle separate from this video and I will have it posted on YouTube. So I'm just going in uh, with uh, these products and then uh, just twisting my hair and then I will leave my hair to air dry because I do not do uh, like blow dry my hair so I just leave my hair to air dry and then I will style it uh, maybe tomorrow uh, because you know uh, blow dry is not bad but you know too much of anything is not always good so if you like blow drying your hair you wanna like minimize on uh, doing blow dry on your hair because it may end up uh, damaging your hair so but for me I really do blow dry on my hair like the last time I did blow dry on my hair it was in December last year so I'm just gonna leave my hair to a dry and I will style it later and I hope this video was helpful and you enjoyed watching and I'm so glad 
that you have watched my video to this end and i really really appreciate and continue watching to the end and i just want to say bye and see you in my next video